Hey guys, what's going on? Welcome to a brand new video, and this is the Swagtron T1. It retails for $400 at Amazon, Best Buy, and other retailers. So by now, you've definitely heard about exploding hoverboards. Well, this one won't explode because it's the world's first UL approved hoverboard. It has the same top speed as the original hoverboards, around 6 to 8 miles an hour. Now let's compare the two. The foot pads on the Swagtron look much cooler, and they're non-slip. They also have different wheel designs. The Swagtron has an exposed rim design versus the hoverboard's closed rim. It has a built-in beginner mode which makes it much easier for first-time users. Just double press the power button and you're all set. The battery has lasted three days of on and off use, but we sadly discovered that our unit is defective. When we went to plug it in, it wouldn't charge. So we contacted support and they're already sending us out a new one. So A plus for you, Swagtron support. So let's get back to the UL approval. The Swagtron T1 has a fire retardant plastic shell and rubber foot pads. On the inside, it has an aluminum shell around the battery, keeping all, if any, explosions enclosed. They also go through rigorous tests to ensure that their product is safe. Oh, and I almost forgot, here's what you get inside the box. You get rubber wheel guards, a user's manual, charger, and the main unit. The Swagtron is definitely a smoother ride than the original hoverboards. Sometimes the originals freak out like this, but the Swagtron doesn't due to new technology inside. It can also take a tumble pretty well due to the big rubber wheel guards. Swagtron is also coming out with a more advanced model, the T3, coming out later this summer. This one will go for 500 instead of 400. But let's get back to the T1 model. The Swagtron T1 is definitely the best hoverboard on the market right now. So come to the dark side and get a Swagtron. Oh, and don't forget to go subscribe to Boomcraft32 because he let me use his Swagtron in the video. So that's it for the review. If you enjoyed it, please give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe. I'll see you guys next time. Peace.